I'm sure you've seen purses like this. These purses use purse frames. Sometimes they're called kiss lock frames or purse clasps. I just love how the metal purse frame adds a really professional look to your purse. They look so smart and they are ideal for special occasion and wedding wear. Every year when spring comes around, I always get a flurry of orders in my shop from thrifty seamstresses wanting to make their own bridal clutches. Not only do these clever seamstresses save a whole heap of money by making their own clutches, they get to wear beautiful purses that match their gorgeous dresses perfectly. Purse frames are actually quick and easy to use. The only tricky thing might be making up a pattern to your purse frame. This is because purse frames come in so many shapes and sizes that they don't usually come supplied with a pattern. Fear not though, today I'll be showing you how easy it is to fix up your own pattern and how to make your own cute clutches. Today we're going to work with rectangular purse frames because the rectangular shape is a classic and it's a great place to start your purse frame addiction. Make one of these purses and I'm pretty sure it won't be your last. Now, I could just show you how to make a plain purse frame purse, but today we're going to have a little more fun with our purse. I'm going to show you how easy it is to zhuzh things up with some preppy pleats and we're going to add a pretty flower pin on the top. This version is a cute daytime clutch. I have used bright coloured fabrics and topped it off with this sweet flower brooch. This clutch would look great with jeans or with a pretty dress. How cute does this purse look? To show you how versatile this purse is, I'm going to show you how to make the exact same purse, but I'm going to demonstrate it using bridal satin. I've also added on this amazing glittery brooch. You'll be able to whip up this gorgeous clutch in less than 45 minutes, and no one is going to believe you made it yourself. Before we begin, I'm going to talk a little bit about purse frames and what kind of fabrics and interfacings are best to use. 